Alright, let's go. Coach, how far of a run is it to where the uh, workout? Three miles. Three miles. You take three miles. Alright, so we're gonna do uh, we're gonna go out to Shaw Mountain Road. Here's where we're headed. A hill workout we do quite frequently throughout the cross country season. We usually do it every other week, but we go out and uh, have them start out and run about 60 seconds up the hill, and then uh, kind of mark their spot, and then kind of progressively get get harder, a little faster as the workout goes on. So. Today we're gonna to do somewhere between 12 and 16, just depending on where the route is at. Um, just kind of a regenerative workout where we get out there and conform up and down the hills and don't tax the system too much, but get a little bit of work done. So we worked hard, hard on Tuesday, and today is just a chance to kind of get the legs moving, get up and get down, and feel good. And, and uh, you know we'll be out the door tomorrow morning with a long run. So it was a good old year there for our team camp. Same group as Tuesday, okay? Make sure, I don't want the first, don't, don't kill the first one, so you have to go further. Okay, nice and relaxed on that first one. Mark a spot, and then we'll get to going. Okay, let's go. Watch the traffic, stay to the right. athletes are pretty much having conversations while they're doing it. Is that like the goal to kind of be able to? Yeah, we don't want this to, I mean, we're, we're less than 10 days out from the conference meet. We want to do anything that's too taxing for the group. So I want them to feel good. Naturally, I mean, like just the number of reps that we're doing naturally, it's just going to get faster as it goes. It's human nature. So, you know, the last, you know, three, four, five, they're going to get going a little bit just naturally. So, um, yeah, just kind of want to walk away from it feeling good. And like I said, have a good long run tomorrow. And, Get ready for next week. Ooh. Got a big old hole in my underwear. <laughs> oh, I'll put that in the video. Yeah, make sure you got that like it's in there. <laughs> I know the one you didn't catch once it hits. You know what? Yeah. What was it? Is it? Yeah. <laughs> different case than, than what you would normally think. I think for her, we've uh, had a tendency to, to train a little less intensity with her. And, and she, you know, she runs a little bit harder on her regular aerobic runs, so um, to kind of counteract that a little bit, just where her fitness is. Um, you know, she's probably holding back a little bit during this workout to run back with Mintu and, and Gracie, but uh, um, it's just kind of all part of kind of putting all the pieces together for her, so. There's certain things that we'll do, like, you know, when we go out and run a progression run or an eight mile threshold run, she's gone, she's run on her own, you know, she keeps it, you know, her, her paces are, you know, shoulders above what everybody else can do, so that's just a different, something different that she does that, you know, you can't run as a group.
Go. No pain. What are your goals you put on the team for 2016? Uh, well, make it again. I suppose that's always the first step. I think you can get too cocky in there and then stay like too, um, like too far ahead. But I don't know, like, I suppose top 10 is obviously something that we're really going to aim for now and then next year and then just keep building, I suppose, yeah. Training is done in like a calculated manner and that's what Immels is really good about is um, training not necessarily super hard but super smart. And so I'm trying to and I'm starting to not get confidence from a specific workout but from the training overall because um, the week before Wisconsin on Friday I had the worst workout of my life like I was crying afterwards because I was like oh my gosh like what happened like I had to run so much slower than like than what the paces were called for and um, but, I mean, it just goes to show, like, the next workout or the next week is a new week.